guys this is uh, example 2 in the topic of permeability uh, in the area of ship stability so please make sure you watch my previous videos and especially the previous example on permeability which also discuss the theory on it i have given the links in the description section below uh, today i'll take up a different example in the topic of permeability because uh, this solves the question a bit differently and i'll explain why it does so because you might get uh, this question in the exam and then you might think what is happening here and why are we doing this differently from the previous example so let's get started uh, this question says that the ship is floating in salt water or sea water and it is on an even keeled draft of six meters all right the tpc which stands for tons per centimeter immersion is 20 tons now what is the def definition of ten tpc tpc is the amount by which the ship is immersed or rises by one centimeter uh, so if if i say 20 tons 20 tons means for every 20 tons of cargo loaded the ship will immerse by one centimeter okay then a rectangular shaped compartment located midships in the ship is about 20 meters long 10 meters wide and 4 meters deep so they have given you the dimensions of the tank as well the compartment contains cargo with a permeability of 25 percent when i say 25 percent of permeability immediately when you hear percentage this is 25 by 100 because it's 25 percent so the permeability will be written as 0.25 all right you cannot say 25 percent in the exam in the exam in the formula you cannot put 25 percent you have to put a number so 25 percent means 25 by 100 which is 0.25 what you have to find is the new raft if the compartment is bilged all right now this question is different from the one we've done previously on permeability and i'll show you how and how it is different and why we are doing it so in this case here the buoyancy which has been lost by the compartment will be the volume of the compartment here is 20 by 10 by 4 then we have the permeability here which is denoted by the letter u this is the volume of the bilged compartment all right multiplied by the density so whenever we multiply volume by density we are getting some kind of a weight so we are basically sort of calculating the weight by which the weight of the water that has basically entered the compartment we are basically calculating how much weight has entered the compartment now in the previous example of permeability we didn't do that because uh, we were not given the information we didn't have to do that so when we are given such kind of specific information when you start seeing tpc the importance of seeing tpc in the question means that now you have to you know the tpc means you know how much weight sinks a vessel by one centimeter that means now you have to find out how much weight has entered the compartment or it has been loaded into the compartment so that you can use a tpc value and find out how much was the immersion so as soon as we find out the weight of the water that has loaded in the carbon that is 205 tons and we have the tpc so for every 20 tons we have one centimeter immersion so in this case ship will be immersed by 205 tons which has entered the compartment with the permeability divided by the tpc of 20 tons that means for 205 tons loaded the ship has now immersed by 10.25 centimeters 205 divided by 20 but the draft is not given to us in centimeters it is given to us as six meters so we convert the centimeters into meter one meter is equal to 100 centimeters so therefore 10.25 centimeters will be equal to 10.25 divided by 100 which is equal to 0 0.1025 meters this is the amount by which the ship has immersed now the old draft given to us is six meters the immersion is 0 0.01025 of course it will immerse because as the compartment starts to take in the water all right so imagine this is the ship there is a midship compartment here and it's now taking in water i'll show the water with blue color it's taking in water now but there was also some cargo because of which there's a permeability of 25 percent so water has come in here how much is the water 205 tons how did you calculate that volume of the tank 
multiplied by the density but also you have to take into account the permeability because because of the cargo the compartment fully didn't fill up fully with water it filled up only partially with water 75 percent of it probably filled up with water so immediately you know how much weight of water went into that compartment now if every 20 tons is leading to an immersion of one centimeter so 205 tons will lead to immersion of 10.25 centimeters so that would mean an immersion of 0.1025 meters because 10.25 centimeters is equal to 1.1025 meters so there will be an immersion you add the immersion to the original draft and the new draft that you get is 6.1025 which is given here so that's the answer so with permeability watch out for the values that are given to you in the question and then use them accordingly that is the trick i'll take up more examples in the future so that you keep using or rather keep uh, uh, the, you keep watching the videos on bilging and permeability i want to take up more and more examples because this is a bit of a complicated topic and i want you to watch many examples here so that you can have a good understanding and you can answer or attempt any question that comes in the exam let me know what you think about this videos guy i look forward to your feedback thanks and bye